Hello everybody, um, today we're going to be learning how to download Team Fortress 2 Classic. This is a comprehensive guide, it tells you, it teaches you everything you need to know, including an extra step that a lot of the other guides skip over and a lot of people have trouble downloading the game with because the, the other guys don't cover the others, that step. So first we're going to be, you're going to want to go to the TF2 Classic website, tf2classic.com slash download or without the slash download. Um, if, if you're at the website, just click the download button. It'll take you to the download page. And it's going to be step one, downloading SDK 2013 multiplayer. First, what you want to have to do is you're going to make sure you're on either Windows or Linux. And this is a Windows guide. Um, and you have to make sure you're logged in and you have Steam installed. That's a very important step. So you want to click that. It's gonna, it's gonna ask, it, if your computer is like restricted, it's gonna ask you, oh, can I ask permissions or whatever, just allow it. Allow practically everything here. And once you have it installed, it should show up in your Steam library under tools. Uh, right here, source SDK base 2013 multiplayer. Multiplayer is very important, not single player. Um, and after you're done with that, you want to make sure you're going to go you're going to step 2 getting the downloader but before you do that is a very important step you have to make sure your download location is the right location so you're going to want to go to to the top 3 the little three dots in the top right corner click settings then you search you can you can find it download location you want to change that to your source mod folder so i have it right here um okay. So you're gonna wanna go to this PC, whatever primary like whatever primary um hard drive you're on. You wanna go to program files x86, you wanna go to Steam, then Steam apps, then source mods. Make sure it's in that order precisely. This PC, whatever, like like C colon, whichever hard drive has the C colon on it, program files x86, Steam, Steam apps, and then source mods. Very specific. Then you that select that folder. Now, everything you download will go into that folder. So next, what you're going to want to do is you want to download for Windows, if you're on Windows. Click that. Then in the top right corner, it's going to show you this little download thing. I, I have I have like this security thing, so it's just scanning it. You don't have to do that. So after it's done downloading, you have you want to click you want to click it. It's going to ask you for permissions. You're going to click say yes, and now it's going to open up this this win this window here. TFC downloader appears to be up to date. Source mods folder was automatically found at here because we set because remember we set the location to there. And you want to and you want to say why enter. Welcome to TF TF2C downloader. Enter number to continue. Um, one since you want to install the game. Starting the download for TF2 Classic. You may see some errors that are safe to ignore. And after this point, it's practically just following instructions and waiting for stuff to be downloaded. So it's it's not it's like it's not it's not really anything that you need a guide for. It already already instructs you on how to on how to install it. So while this is downloading, after after it's done downloading. You just wanna you just wanna run the command. It says right here, simply run tf2c downloader.windows.exe. And you have to also bypass a warning saying that it's untrusted app. It's not like a virus or anything. Just allow it. And after you've in after you've gotten the downloader and you've installed the game, uh you have to restart Steam, which uh you 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 restart Steam by clicking the Steam thing, and then, and then clicking, clicking exit, right here, 
and then reopening Steam. And that will basically restart it and let the computer know that, hey, it's downloaded. And once you've done that, um, the game should appear in your library. So, this is like, this has nine seconds left, eight, seven, six. So once this is over, I'm going to demonstrate what that would look like to, to, to you. Whoever's downloading it. Um, now you just have to wait for, just wait for the computer to download it, extracting the downloaded archive. Please wait patiently. And this is going to take a while. So, while you're at it, if you have any trouble with this, um, I don't know, join their Discord and ask for help. Uh, that's, that's all the, that's all the help I can really give you. I mean, if this doesn't work, then you're kind of screwed, honestly. I don't want to, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. <laughs> sugarcoat it. And once the installation is, is successfully completed you just click enter to exit then you restart steam wait for that to shut down then you reopen it if it will load Then you want to go to your library, and it should appear here. Hold on. Yeah, right there. Team Fortress 2 Classic, right there. Just, okay. And, um, that's the guide. That's it.